why did you have to leave me and my son this way? <laughs> Mommy should have waited for me to, to come back and take you to the hospital. Now I answer a name that I'm not. And you're not even here. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. I feel so bad. <laughs> Now you're not even here. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Mom. I miss you so much. I miss you so much. This is so much for me to say. I miss you, Mom. I miss you. <laughs> mm -hmm. So what are we going to do now that her number is not reachable? Eh? And we don't even know where she's walking. Don't worry. Tomorrow I'll be again to pay that agent a visit. And if he doesn't take me to where Sandra is, I'll go show him small Chris. He'll be forced to take me to where she is. But on a second thought, what if our sister has decided to abandon us and move on with her life? How is that even possible? Sandra cannot do anything like that. It's not possible. I know. But what I'm saying is that that agent is not at fault here. Our sister is at fault. She should have called to know how we are doing because she knows that we'll be worried about her. And now her number is not even reachable. See, Oma, all this one you are saying is none of my business. How are you even sure Sandra is safe? Eh? What if she's in danger? You're here blabbing that she, didn't, she did not reach us. What if she's not safe? Okay, mm. you, you did not think about that one, Abby. That's true, that's true. Oh God, I'm so scared right now. God, please, protect our sister wherever she is. Don't worry, nothing will happen to her. I pray. Figure out a way to reach her tomorrow. <sighs> okay. So what are we going to eat? Eat? You're sounding as if there's something in this house. There's nothing in this house. Mm. Madam, Madam, I need to speak to my sister. I need to see my sister, it is urgent. Then call her. Madam, her number is not reachable. See, Madam, I told you. Give me her boss's number, you refuse. Take me to the place my sister works. See, ma Madam, I'll change it all. Madam, if I put call, you take me to where my sister works today. Oh. Young man, calm down. It's not like I don't want to give you the phone number or probably the address, but I think it's not wise. Eh? Okay. You know what will happen? I'll just go there and tell her that you want to see her. No, How about that? No, Madam, that will not work. See, I am supposed to know where my sister works and be able to visit her any time I like. See, madam, right now we have three options. It's either you are giving me her boss's number, or you are taking me there yourself, or you give me her address and, and I go myself. That is the options you have now. Okay, I'll give you the address. Better. But the problem is that you can't even enter the gate without the access code. Yeah. Um, you know what, I'll just give you the boss phone number. Madam, your phone. Anyone you want, you just give me. Call the number, I'll, I'll cram it. When I get there, I'll, I'll use my friend's phone to call. Okay. Uh, 081. Uh, 081. Honestly, girl, I wish that night never happened. Forget about it. It's in the past now. What do you mean it's in the past? I continuously think about it every day. How do you mean? Girl, how is do I explain this thing to you now? How? Forget about that guy. It is his ego that is killing him. And that's his business. Let him deal with it. You know, I swear. If I didn't need this money, I would have left this house. I would just sack myself. Just, just go. Focus on your job. I mean, just do as if you don't even know him. Get him off your mind. It's not that easy. Remember I told you what happened between us that night? He was sweet, crazy, romantic. Oh, damn, my head is messed up, girl. Yeah. But hey, it wasn't supposed to be intimate. I don't know why you guys get that lovely done. Honestly, I think that's one of your problems right now. 
wishing to have more of him. No. I didn't say that. I know you won't admit it. But trust me, I know that feelings. You're crazy. Yeah. What? Your time in this house is up. Start going. Which one is? I, I want more of him. I mean, come and go. I, which kind of talk is that one? You're crazy, Abby. So in your mind now, you want to send me away? Running away from the truth. <laughs> There's no truth. I'm tired. I'm not joking. Your friend is exhausted mentally, man. Just look at I'm coming. Hold on, please. Um, Hi. Hi. Good evening, sir. Yeah, good evening. Sir, please, who are you? My name is Steve. I am Davian's friend. Okay, um, he's not around. I know. I called him and he said he's on his way, so... Okay. Uh, who are you? Are you his sister or...? Oh, no. I'm his housekeeper. Um, do you need anything? Whiskey, wine, water? Um, no. I'm fine. Okay, so... Thank you. All right. Enjoy your stay then. Thank you. Okay, so... Take it easy, huh? Sure. Um, sir, please, I, I want to ask you for your permission. I want to quickly go see my siblings. It's been a long time, sir. But I promise I'll be back before you know it. Which one is you want to go and see your siblings? Huh? Auntie, just say you have an appointment. I say you want to go and see your siblings. I don't understand. Huh? Sir, I... I do not have an appointment, sir. The thing is, I promised my siblings I'll come see them two weeks ago. But I've been so busy with work. That's why I want to go see them now that I'm done with all my chores. Uh, look, I get it. Weekend vibes. I don't want to dull your energy. Just go. Have fun. Nobody is going to stop you. Nobody will beat you. Do you understand? Go. It's okay, sir. I'll go some other time. Uh, go now. No one is stopping you. Go and have, don't you want to make money? Huh? Your client is waiting for you. No, sir. I. Thank you, sir. I, I'll go some other time. Why are you? Why are you? Why are you? Why are you like this now? Like what? How the poor girl go see her siblings now? She says she's done with her chores. Why are you behaving like this? Which kind of dirty siblings? Yeah, she's not going to see any siblings. She's going to see a man. How are you sure that she's going to see a man? And even if she's going to see a man, is she not an adult? You don't. Oh, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? You don't understand, bro. <laughs> so give me a sec. Can someone go see siblings? Say, I'll go see ma. Yeah? Who is this? You want to speak with who? Wait, how did you get this number? Listen, don't call this line again, okay? Can you imagine this babe? Who is that? Hey! Sandra! 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 Yes, sir? Your boyfriend just called. He said he wanted to speak with you. My boyfriend? Sir, I do not have a boyfriend. My friend, will you be quiet? You probably stood the guy up and he called to find out if you're still coming. 
Look, I can't do this shit with you. Don't ever give out my number again. Do you understand me? Sir, I don't even have your number. Not to talk or give it out to somebody. D Damian, why are you behaving like this? Why do you always attack this girl now? Yeah, you don't, you, you don't understand. I know this girl. She does runs. Ah! Sir, I, I don't do runs, sir. Baba, free this babe, I beg. Ah, every time she, she does runs, she, how you take me to say she did? You, you, you follow and go do the runs. Huh? This kind of innocent girl. Innocent with him. See her face, now. very innocent, fine girl. And people like you, they, they deceive easily. But even you yourself, you know they do runs, girls. So be if you. God, how do I get money to give to Oma now? My salary is not enough to send her to school and pay for everything that she needs. And I can't let Oma down. What do I do? What do I do? I'm even yet to receive my salary and expenses everywhere. Let Oma down. So out of way. Oh, so out of way. Oma, sis, hope you've heard all I've said. Make sure you. Concentrate on your studies, okay? Okay. Oma C, university comes with a lot of pressure. Just know that if you need anything, we have an elder sister you can count on, all right? Okay. Don't sis. allow your friends <laughs> spoil you. I will not. Okay. I've heard what you say. <laughs> Where is Peter? Oh, he has gone to get my privilege. Okay. And I hope the full stops I got for you can last you for some weeks. Sister Witsy said, to be enough for me for a month, I also manage everything that you and Peter has gotten for me so far. That's good to know. That's good to know. Okay, pack up, pack up, pack up. Yeah. Thank you very much for everything, sis. I beg you. I think it will go. <laughs> you now I'll do more if I have. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Thank you. Man, my office people are stressing me out. Are you serious? Bro, all those my junior colleagues, my junior staff. All right. Thank you. But, guy, why don't you just leave all those useless girls that you're following outside and focus on this fool housewife that is under your roof like this? <laughs> and who are you referring to? I'm talking about Sandra. If I were you, this girl is a good girl. If I were <laughs> you, I would put a ring on her finger and make her mine forever. Sandra? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I can't marry her, bro. Hey, but you testify to the fact that she's respectful, homely, and even hardworking. So why, why can't you marry her? Did I also add that she's very, very good in bed? <laughs> oh my goodness, this guy. <laughs> Livian, how did you know that fact? Well, I had a one night stand with her a while ago before she showed up at my house this, as a housekeeper. This, this guy. <laughs> You be mad, like how, how, how did it happen? I don't know bro, life happens. But then again, a one night stand can't be an event for you to just write her off like that. Don't you think? Guy, you don't understand what I'm saying. 
She's a call girl. She does hook up. Ta. Ta, come on, keep quiet there. This girl that like this girl that looks like a good girl like this does hook up with her with her innocent face. Bro, looks can be very deceptive. Are you sure you're not mistaking this girl for someone else? Guy, even she recognized me when she came to my house. Trust me, if that girl wasn't a call girl, my search would have been over the minute she stepped into my house. Man, this is sad. Really, really sad. But then I saw life be you. Ah, girls of nowadays. But Shai is a bad guy. So you don't... This guy. This guy. You don't... Yeah. <laughs> 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 That's so good. That's you decrease. You decrease. <laughs> How you doing? Good. Where are you headed? I'm going home. Oh, today is your lucky day. I'm going to your house also. I'm going to see Davion. Okay. Hop in, let me give you a ride. Sure, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Have a great. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Come on, man. Oh, come on. I was supposed to open the door for you. It's okay, thank you. It's cool. So, um, I think I'm going to see you next time, right? Thank you so much. Where are you coming from? Yo, Davian, what's good? Um, I went to the market, sir. What? You've been at the market since morning? Yes. I hope you know you can't do runs wow. in my house. So I went to the market. And I told you before I left. Let's go inside and look for you. Stop. Stop. Davian, what is your problem? Why are you always policing this girl? If you like this girl, speak up now. This is childish. Guy, yeah, I beg, free me. Seriously, what is your problem? I don't have a problem. I just don't want her messing up herself in my house. <laughs> I don't want her messing up herself. Based on her papa, where you be now? You're the chingom, and based on her papa, where you be? Papito! Papito, patese! Guys, you don't need men, have you? <laughs> guy, I know you feel something for this girl. I know, you can't hide. I'm your guy. I know you feel something for this girl. Even if I do, I can't have anything to do with that girl. She belongs to the street. She does hook up. I'm sure she's probably coming from a hotel or, or some guy's house. You know, it makes sense now. But I've told you, man. You like her, speak up. Now you know where you, now you know where she they come from. Now me, I had this since. I don't know what you they talk. It concerns you. You like person talk.
calling you. Look through the clothes. Eh? I left my call upstairs. I'm cleaning. You see? No. I didn't mean you pick my call. I would have come to help you out. <laughs> it's okay. So tell me, why are you here? Oh my no leave. Sis, I just came to see you and Peter, that's all. That's sad. <laughs> or someone is broke. <laughs> Not really, but I wouldn't mind for people. Mm. <laughs> now you've said the real reason you're here. <laughs> oh, my see. You know the work I'm doing. I don't have so much money and my pay is not so good. But it's okay. I can't send it to you, right? Uh, we'll see what I can do. See, it's any amount to be appreciated. Mm. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, just sweet mouth. <laughs> um, Alright, now that you're here, go get the broom sweep. Um, I clean. Okay. Before money, okay? Alright, we need to work together. <laughs> Uh, it's okay, don't worry. Hi, Oma. Are you leaving? Yes, I am. Okay. Which way are you going to? I'm going to Clifford Road. Oh, uh, that's not my direction, but I can drop you somewhere close. Okay, if you insist. <laughs> All, right, All right, let's go. Thank you. No problem. Hi. Hi. Um, it's Sandra in. Um, she just stepped inside to get something. Oh, okay. Do I know you somewhere? Your face equally looks familiar, but I can't place it. Same here. Did you attend Bella Jake's Academy? Yes, I did. 2002 session. Yeah, I knew it. Now I recognize you. Okay, but I'm sorry, I, I still can't place your face though. I attended Bella Jets too. Oh, nice, nice. You are that wicked, punctual little <laughs> prefect that don't flog like an L. Now I remember your name, <laughs> Stephen good. Badmos. Oh my goodness, this is so embarrassing. I'm so sorry there. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but how are you? How is life treating you? Fair enough. Okay, I can see that. Well, nice meeting you, by the way. Same here. So, tell me, are you a relative of Sandra? We are best friends. Oh, nice, nice, yeah. nice, nice. Sounds interesting. Nice meeting you again. Though. Same here. <laughs> You're looking bad. Hey, baby sis. Yes, sis. Sis, guess what? What? You had a free ride. He told me he drove you all the way. Oh, that's not the big deal. Then what? Sis, your boss gave me 50k. For real? Sis, that man is so nice. We had some little chats while on the ride, and when he stopped the car, he asked me for my account details. And then I got an alert of 50k. Oh my god, oh my that is so cool. 50k is like it's more than half of my salary. Sis, please help me and thank him. I'll do that right away. I'm so happy that you're happy, Oma. Yeah, come in. Come in. Sir, I came to say thank you for the money you gave to my sister. Thank you so much, sir.
Elsa? Yeah. I came to say thank you for the money gift to my sister. I cannot continue to stay in this house. Whenever I see Damien, I get tormented. I need to let go of my past. And in order to let go of my past, I have to take a move. Everything about this house reminds me of that night I don't want to remember. Makes me feel like who I am not. And Damien is not even my upper Marcus. He probably doesn't want me. He's obviously tired of me but doesn't know how to say it. Coffee is right. I'll get another job. I need to take a step. <sighs> to hell with however I feel about him. Enough. <sighs> Hello, Sandra. Sandra, Sandra, please come. I'm, I'm in pain. I'm in serious pain. When I, when I got to the field this morning, I, I got injured. I was thinking it's something that would just go away, but as it stands now, I'm, I'm in serious pain. It's like my, my legs are almost swollen. I can't walk. Sa Sandra, I can't walk. I'm at home. Please hurry, please hurry. Mr. Steve, thank you so much for the money you gave to my brother. You have no idea how far that money went for us. Thank you so much. Come on, don't mention. It's just thank you now. Thank you is not just when you're in need, though. Thank you so much, yeah. sir. I promise when my boss pay me my monthly salary, I'll give you back. I promise. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I don't need your money, man. Just consider it an assistance from me. Are you sure? 100% sure. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Listen. Please. Don't call me, sir. Call me Steve, okay? What's going on here? Um, welcome, sir. I, 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 I'll, I'll be in the kitchen. What's up, bro? I went to the lounge, I didn't see you, so I decided to come check you at home, and I still met your absence. And you are not taking your calls, my man. I wasn't in a good mood. Why? Remember that girl I met at the gym? Yes, what about her? She stole $5,000 from me, and she also stole my watch. No way! How? We went out on a date and we were in the car. I guess that's when it happened. Oh my goodness, all these girls of nowadays. I'm so sorry, bro. It's all good. <sighs> well, I've waited enough, so I guess I have to start running right now because somebody's waiting for me at the office. And I'll see you later in the evening at the lounge, yeah? Be strong, man. All these girls, man. See you later, bro. Mm -hmm. Sandra? Sandra? Um, sir? Sir?
Yes, sir. Very soon, I'm going to find out what you're doing with him. And when I do, you won't like me. I don't understand, sir. You don't understand. You don't understand that you were doing K-drama with him, holding his hands when I walked in. Hmm? What do you think this place is? The hotel? Um, I'm very sorry, sir. Sir, please, I have an emergency. I, I need to go see my brother. Fine. Thank you, sir. Sister, th thank God you're here. Peter. Sister, please take it easy. Take, take it easy, please. Peter. Sister, I've told you to be careful. This is a football game now. Who's kind of be this one? So what are we going to do now? I, I don't know, sister. I've been massaging it, but there's a specialist that can take it on. They'll put the bone back in place. Yeah. Mm. Thank God. So where? Well, Mommy Brenda says she knows the place. But it's very expensive. How much? She said between thirty to thirty-five thousand. But I don't have that amount of money. What I came with is eight thousand five hundred. Ah, sister, eight five is too small, though. You should have told me now. I would have come prepared. How would I know that you you have thirty thousand naira now? So, if we pay the money, they can fix your leg and you start working again. Yes, you just put the bone back in place and everything will be fine. See, uh, if, if I pay for this money, this is your football team. If this thing happens again, you use the money and pay. Don't worry. After this one, you not pay again. Let, let me just let this leg just come back in shape first. Expenses, expenses everywhere. Don't worry. When, when, I, when I go abroad, I'll, I'll, I'll pay you back. Payback or payback. Steve, I appreciate you so much. Thank you for all that you've done for us. You're welcome. I just wanted to make sure that you guys had everything sorted out. And I am so sorry for taking your time. Oh, come on, man. You didn't take my time. It's cool. It's cool. It's nothing. Steve, you're so caring. And you're so beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Tamja. Yes. Can I ask you a question? Sure. Go ahead. Do you have a boyfriend or are you in any relationship? Why are you asking? Sandra, I really, really like you. And I want to get to know you more. I am um, I am single, but I am not ready for a relationship i'm what? not interested why are you recovering from a heartbreak oh no far from that it's just that i do not have the mental strength to build a relationship right now <laughs> is that what you're talking build, build i will help you build it baby girl what what do you want to build is it duplex or bungalow <laughs> self -con? which one do you want baby girl, you don't know my nickname in the hood <laughs> They call me Mason now. I carry <laughs> cement on my head. <laughs> I'm serious though. I really, really like you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, uh, need to start the car. Let's go. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Sorry for staying like that. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, baby. There you go. Thank you. Mm. So tell me. Tell me everything I need to know. Uh, uh, uh. 
<laughs> good evening, sir. Hi, good evening. And uh, how is your brother? He's fine, sir. So have you had dinner? What do you want me to make for you? Well, I'm, I'm fine. Um, my baby made us something to eat. Who is she? She's my housekeeper. Thank you so much, ma. Thank you. Um, so are you sure you don't want anything at all? I mean, anything I can do it now for you. No, no, I'm fine. You can go to bed. Okay, sir. Good night. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, ma. Ma, if you need anything, so you can call on me, okay? Thank you, ma. Okay, you're welcome. What do you mean, what do you mean by you're welcome? <laughs> what was I supposed to say? Cut off the things. It's your duty. Come on, sweetheart. We are not legally married yet. And come to think of it, she's your worker. Don't you think she has more obligation than I do? Eh? What's the first for? Come on. <laughs> mm. Come on, baby. I was only pulling your legs. Mm. Come on, baby. Who's just pulling your legs now? Oh, my dear, his wife to be is around, so she's in charge. What's that? And my boss said anytime his girlfriend is around, I should let her do all the things. Oh, okay. That means you can come out now. Come to where? Come now, let's hang out. I beg you, today that's my off day, they want me to come out. I want to rest though. Okay, so should I come? Hey, come now, why not? I will have something I wanted to give to you about. Lie, lie. You want to use that one to drag me out? Mm -hmm. Anyhow, just come, 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 for real, for real. Okay, I will come later in the evening. Hey, baby girl, see you, bye. <laughs> wow. Wow. 
<laughs> my guy, my guy. Hold on. Alpha. What's your see now? Just the you know a big man now. Big boy! <laughs> big boy! Stop him money! Which money? Money! Which money? Well, you can't go say be your friend. No. Where do you think? Where do you think? Where do you think? Where do you want me? I said, Ah! Oh, my good job. Where's our car well? Our car well. Our wife, our wife. Yes. Wifey, wifey. <laughs> Any other wifey is a counterfeit. <laughs> Calm down now. Uh, look everywhere set first. I was shop since. I was shop since. Go just the boil. I want for you. Hi, our wife. It's okay. This is your last bus stop. It's okay. This is your last bus stop. It's okay. This is your last. If I see, wifey, if I see him with any shanker, I report. Get up. Hmm. Devia. Where go now? Your blood. Okay, yes. guys, the table is set. Are you a fool? Yes. Hey, our wife. <laughs> God bless you. Amen. What kind of reception is this? Maybe you're busy shouting amen. <laughs> what kind of reception is this? I've never gotten this kind of reception in a while. Hey. Okay. All right. Take it first. Oh, thank you. Sorry. Anya, you just took two. Let your friend have one. <laughs> mm. Okay. Talk now, do say I'm talking. <sighs> okay, since you can't help yourself, let me help you. It smells nice. <laughs> thank you. Can you help yourself, please? What? what? Help what? yourself. No, help no, it's yourself. cool, it's cool. I'll help myself. <laughs> oh, I've almost finished this rice. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll help you, don't worry. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. okay. No, no problem. <laughs> Do you have a hole in your stomach? And do you need the head of the fish? I never, I never ah. He's the head now, so give him the head. need the head. <laughs> He's the, the head, head. give him the head of the fish. Give the head. I don't, uh -huh. mind. I don't mind being the tail. <laughs> have it. Hey. Enjoy your meal, baby. Ah, so I should still... Mm. Mm. Okay. It's fine, you can leave it here. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome, honey. Our wife, our wife. I want to watch you eat. Right. No, I'm fine. You don't have to watch. Our wife, our wife. Okay. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Thank you so much. We can take it from here. Okay. Yes. Okay, let me wait at the kitchen. Now, boss, stop. <laughs> if I catch you with any other woman, you're in trouble. Yeah, what's it with this? Huh? This looks like a disaster. Oh. Is, is this fish even fried? No, it's parboiled now. I parboiled it. And you are eating it? Mm. My brother. If your belly run now, they go talk to you in my house, you chop. What's this? Oh, I'll buy a new liver salt for that pharmacy where they front of your estate. Why is this still so. Oily. Eat now, the complaints. Why would you like this? Sandra! I can't take this. Sandra! Yes, sir! Best not true, you talk one. This thing wants to spoil my. No, eat it, enjoy it. It wants to spoil my taste buds. Enjoy but... it. Sandra. Sir? Please clear this rubbish and make me something to eat. Ah. Uh. Honey, you're done already. <laughs> uh, let me get you some more now, yes. you know? Get him some I more. I hope you are really enjoying the meal. He's enjoying it. Well, okay. Uh, mm. Honey, what? I'm fine. Um, Sandra. Salt. Salt. Mm. Salt. 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 Sal
Okay. But they are not done eating now. Bring the place. Why are you clearing the table? Baby. Your friend is still eating. He's enjoying yes. the meal. Find out from Sandra why she cleared the table. Sandra, why will you clear the table now? For what? Now they're still eating. Sandra! You will eat poison one day. No way. I wish you well. I'll buy Andrew Liver short for that time you feel different from that. Enjoy. Do you need help? No, I can do it. I can do it in a few minutes. But you've been on this shirt for like 30 minutes and it still doesn't look smooth. Uh, you were watching me? Yes, I saw when you picked up your first shirt. <laughs> Don't worry, I, I, I can do it. Let me, let me do it. Okay. I am so sorry, ma. Are you okay? So, so sorry. Oh, please, Sandra. Mm? This is not my thing. Please, can you, can you help me do it? It's obvious you can do it, ma. Mom, listen. I feel it's not wrong if women try to be themselves, okay? It's okay for a man to know what you're capable of doing and what you cannot do. You look tense. Sad. I don't know. If it's not your thing, then you shouldn't be doing it. Sandra, truly, I am overwhelmed. Look, I'll help you iron the shirt. Okay. And other shirts. I promise I'm not going to tell him, okay? Can't you say? He said I have to do things that will make him happy. So that's why I'm putting in my effort so that he'll be happy. I just want him to be happy. That's just all I want. I understand you, ma'am. It's fine. I do it. Step aside. I promise you're not going to tell him. I'm not going to tell him. Okay. All right, just um, okay. step aside. Okay. All right, ma'am. Thank you. It's very easy. Let me show you. Okay. Okay, you just have to make sure you pull it right like this, all right? Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Increase the temperature so it gets really hot. Okay. Not so hot, though. And then apply a little bit of pressure. Okay. No, don't worry. It's fine. Just watch, okay? It's... I really like your friend. Please help me talk to her. Steve, the truth is, Sandra has made it clear to me that she isn't ready for any form of relationship right now. So even if I talk from nothing tomorrow, it won't change the fact that she has made up her mind. But you can still just make her see reasons. Just give her one or two reasons why she should give me a chance. Sandra is very dismissive. I mean, to take more than just talk to, to, to change her mind. Like what? what is, it, is it money? I have money. I'll spoil her. I'll take her anywhere she wants to go. Is it Dubai, Europe, Canada, anywhere? That is not it. What I mean is, I can only do the talking. Or it is your action that will convince her. Then do the talking. Just do the talking. Let her just give me a little attention. I'll... I'll, I'll I'll take it off from there, I promise. I will try and see what I can do. Kathy, I promise you I will not let you down. Please, just do this for me. Please. Okay. I will start going. Let me just quickly see her so I can go in. No problem, thank you. Ah, uh, you're welcome. I said the babe no sabi do anything. Guess what? The sweet oha soup we Sandra make yesterday. Mm. Hey, just to go warm up. Now this babe go spoil the soup. <laughs> Guy, she go spoil the soup. I don't even, I don't even understand. I don't understand at all. <laughs> Let me shock you. Oh. To arrange bed, no problem. If you ah. see what she did. If you see what she did. Yeah, I had to go and arrange this bed again by myself. I don't, even, I don't want to see that baby by weekend. I don't uh, want to see uh, her. Uh, uh, uh. You never reach that level now. Calm down. Hmm. And besides, you said this is your last bus stop. Oh. 
Give her time to improve. I know. Can get, make it work. Just I give know, her time. I don't get that kind of patience, guy. I reach bus stop, no means I know if you continue the journey. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, fine. Let me ask you. How long do you want to keep searching? For how long? As long as it takes. Guy, at this rate, I think I'm going to stay unmarried. Hi, yes. Find one fine babe. Give her belly. Baby mama way. <laughs> Oh, you're funny, yo. <laughs> I swear you're funny. But uh, you don't want to go down there. I want to go down there. Do you know that I've seen a lot of old men that regretted this action? This same thing you're saying. They, they said it. Not like they didn't say but they regretted it. Yeah. Bro, loneliness for old age. You know they funny, yo. Don't worry. You know they funny, yo. When we get to that bridge, we'll cross them. Today's bridge, Unko? No, answer me. Today's bridge, Unko? You would easily they board. Any small thing you don't board. Don't worry. Babes, I go find one or two babes who just keep me company. That's all. <laughs> this guy. You, know, you with the talk, you don't marry. You the you don't get person when I marry, the advice person. We, you, I don't understand but, you. But at least I better pass you. You better pass you. I know they jump from da. one. I know they even think, bro. I want to get married. I want to start a family. I know one day. The the only thing I want to get married. I want to start a family mama. for mouth. It is this thing they sweet to plan for mouth now. Good one. You know what to be baby mama. Before you know now, you go, baby, baby mama drama. Baby mama, no, just go drag you online. Insta blog, everybody will carry you. No Say, you know, they pay for child support. <laughs> Continue. Hello, Sandra. I am very, very serious about this. Please give me a chance. Steve, I've told you I'm not ready for any relationship. And I told you, let me work this thing out with us. You can do all the work. It takes two to tango. Then tang tango along with me. <laughs> You're so funny, I won't lie. Sandra, please. You see, I can't, I'm dying to hear you say yes to me. But Steve, I can't say yes when I don't mean it. Okay, fine. Can, can we at least be close friends? I mean close friends like hang out, go on dates, you know, that kind of stuff. You really want this, don't you? I do. Alright, I'll think about it. Thank you. Come on, what are you thanking me for? For giving me a chance. I said I would think about it. At least that one is hope now. <laughs> At least I get hope now. <laughs> Want me again? Did he say that to you? No, no, no. But, but I, I, I can't feel it. Ma, it's so wrong to make assumptions. Okay? No, I am not. I am not. His action towards me have changed. <laughs> you and I know that Damien is not a confrontational person, but, but he has something up his mind. Yes, his action towards me have changed. Ma. Um, I, I think you should clean your tears, okay? I'm sure he will not be happy if he comes down and sees you crying. No. No. 
He's gone out. He's out. He went out without you. You see? You see? That's why he said he doesn't want me anymore. I'm so sorry, ma. I'm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Good time. It's it's late. And I've I've been calling him. He's not taking my call. But the next thing was I saw her lot. With a message attached that he's not coming back till till Monday. And if I won't leave, I, I can leave. I can leave. I can leave. I don't know. It's okay. It's okay, ma'am. It's okay. It's okay, ma'am. It's okay. Ma. It's okay. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. How old are you? How old are you now? Okay, I am Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Today's your birthday and you didn't tell me? Yeah, it's my birthday today. Oh, come on. Is this fair? Uh, well, it's not. So. <laughs> Welcome, Mr. Steve. Yeah. You can join us. Sure, I'm here already, so... <laughs> How are you, Peter? Um, thank you for the other day. Oh. Come on, it's not there now. That's my um, This is my younger sister, Omar. Omar, Mr. Steve. Hmm, Omar. How are Hi. you? Beautiful. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um, since today is her birthday, why don't I take you guys out? Bills on me. Let's go have some yeah, drinks. Yeah, that'd be nice. That's a good uh, idea. Um, no, my boss is not around. I cannot just leave the house like that. Come on, yeah. I'm working for someone, remember? In my house, that's how she is. And it's not in my boss, my boss. Like, my boss is God. Please, let's go. Let's go chill, man. Um, you could just come let's up with something. Let's go, Bill, man. Don't worry. She, she, but she has to make the decision if she yeah, wants to go. Yeah, she has to. <laughs> come on, sister. Just say yes. <laughs> Yes! Uh, oh my god, sorry. Oh. <laughs> it was so nice. <laughs> oh, I hope you enjoyed yourself. Sure, though. sure. Good evening, sir. What is the meaning of this? Steve. What? What are you doing with her? I'm not doing anything with her. I just took her out for her birthday celebration. Her birthday? You took her out as what? As a father? As a brother? As a boyfriend? In what capacity did you take her out as? Davian, why are you getting angry? Why am I getting angry? Yes. You took my house help out of my house without my consent and you're asking me why I'm getting upset? Sir, I'm very sorry, sir. Shut up! You want to sleep around with men? Be my guest, but do not do it under my nose. Are we clear? Yes, sir. Go inside. You know, you really have to take it easy on this girl. You have to take it easy on this girl. I'm not happy about this, Steve. I'm not. I... I'm sorry, but I promise you it was just a harmless outing. I swear. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry now. Ah. You look my guy again. I say I'm sorry, you see the vex. What's up? Now we see the watch, Seth. Devian. Hi. Hey, sweetheart. 
How you doing? I'm all right. Um, your friend is not around. I know. I think she is. To see me. Stevie, you have to stop. Please. Stop what? This is not going to work. Come on now. I thought we've gone past this stage. Actually, I... I was thinking about giving you a try. But this whole thing doesn't make sense. I cannot date my boss's friend. It feels so weird. It doesn't feel weird. It, it, it doesn't. Okay. Okay, fine. How about I pay you monthly what you earn here so you can quit this job? What? I'm really serious about you. I really want you, Sandra. Well, I cannot quit my job. Okay. Fine, like I said, I'll pay you monthly. I'll give you upkeep money. Anything you want, just ask me. I'll give it to you. Steve. I love working, okay? I love spending my own money. And besides, there's dignity in labor. So I can't. Okay, fine. How about I get you a better job? I love this job. So what do you want me to do? What, what do you want me to do now? Because... I'm not going to let go. I'm crazy about you. I, I love you. I want you to be mine. Can't you see? Steve, you need to go now. My boss will be very angry if he comes back and see us discussing. Please, I don't want trouble. I don't want trouble. Are you asking me to leave? Yes. If my boss comes now, he will continuously have wrong impressions. I don't want it. I'm going to pick up something from the laundry. See you later. my room, sir. I'm not sending you away. Please sit. Thank you, sir. You don't always have to flee anytime I come downstairs to watch TV. Okay? Thank you, sir. So, how old did you turn on Wednesday? 24, sir. 24. That's very young and cute for your age. Thank you, sir. I wanted to get you a gift, but I didn't know what you would like. Sir, you don't need to bother yourself. Thank you so much. Steve, did he get you something? Oh, <laughs> nothing, but we went to the cinema together. You like movies a lot, yeah? Yes, yeah, sir. <laughs> yeah, I noticed. Every time I come downstairs to see a movie, you're probably watching something or you slept off watching a movie. <laughs> if I sleep off, it's because the movie was boring. Right. And what is your favorite genre? I like romantic comedies, sir. 
I knew it. Women and romantic films. <laughs> well, I'd like us to see a movie together, if you don't mind. Maybe I could learn a thing or two about romance. Sure, if you want. Um, this one is really nice. This guy is my favorite actor. He's so romantic, sir. Oh. Yes. Right. And, um... I am so going to make very good use of this opportunity. And after that, I will talk to Davian and make him stay off our lane so she can give me all the attention we need to build this relationship. Talking about building a relationship, I think I should get her a first date gift. Will she accept it? Sandra doesn't look materialistic. No, no. I won't go there so I don't end up spoiling things. I'll just make sure we enjoy the outing. Yes, that's what I will do. Don't worry, God will provide. Oh well, yeah, you choose fast, choose fast. Let me um, go out okay. before my boss will come back. Hmm. I think this one is okay, but wait. So, all this plenty peppery that you're doing, is it because of a casual date? Or is there something you're not telling me? There's nothing. There's nothing. Just that I think I want to give Steve a try. Hey, that's my girl. Mm. Very soon, my friend is going to be hooked up. Which one is hooked up? Listen, have you forgotten that the last time I saw a man is what is keeping me in this stigma that I'm in right now? So calm down. <sighs> See this one? There's the time Yam and got together. So you're for me and you're going for a date. <laughs> I beg you. So this one, right? Yeah, this one is fine. This one is okay. See, girl, you need to keep being happy very soon. You are going to have a life to build with this guy. Before you know it, boom, everything will be fine. This new life. I just told you I'm trying, I'm trying. Okay. Yeah. All right. So you, you're going to wear this one? Yes, I'll wear this one, definitely. Mm -hmm. sure. This one is fine. I really love your sister. Uh, why don't you tell her yourself? I have. You think I've not tried? I've told her countless times how, how crazy I am in love with her, but she keeps withdrawing due to one or two reasons. See, sincerely, this is between the both of you. You have to figure out a way to get her to believe you. Peter, please help me. Talk to her, explain to her, tell her that I love her, I'm crazy about her, and I promise you, I swear, I'm not going to disappoint her. I promise. <laughs> Trust me. Uh, it's okay, it's okay. I'll, I'll see what I can do about it, but I am not promising you anything, but I'll try. 
For real? Yeah, I swear to God. Yeah. I swear to God. My man. I appreciate it, bro. Sure, sure. Thank you, thank you. I'm Merci, grateful. Merci. Merci. I actually got you this gift the day I saw you and Steve making out. So we weren't making out. So what were you doing? Tell me, what were you doing? Were you playing? Because if I hadn't interrupted at the time I did, it would have turned into a quickie. Sir, why do you keep doing this? Quickie? Appointment? Why do you keep talking about my past? What is your past? Sir. The girl you met in that hotel? She's not who I am. I'm not a runs girl. And I don't do hookups. But you pull your pants down for money. What does that make you? What happened? Are, are you are you okay? Fine. You're fine. And, and you came with your bag. Did they fire you? Sister, I'm so tired. Oh. Sister, did they sack you or something? Why did you come with your bag? You shouldn't have left now. Say what? I mean, it is not right for you to have left without his notice. If he contacts the agency that took you there, it could mean trouble. Well, at this point, I don't care. I don't. Sandra. Kathy. I don't understand you. Why not the one advising me to leave that house? Yes, but not in this manner. At least you should have told him before leaving. I didn't. I need my sanity, please. Oh my. Hello, Oma. Um, what's going on? Um, I don't have money now. Okay, I'll see what I can do. How much is it? Okay. I guess Oma. <sighs> Kathy. Please, can you borrow me 15000 I need to send to Oma. I will give you back, I promise. Sandra, you know I don't have. Oh God, what am I going to do now? What am I going to do? Oh, mom is okay. But Oma needs money. Oh God. Hey, Deja. Steve. I'm here to see Sandra. Is she in? Why do you lack respect and decency? What do you mean? I find it very insulting that you're frolicking with my mate in my house. You find it very insulting or you're just jealous for the fact that 
You have lost the treasure due to pride. I don't care about your opinion. I need you to stop coming here to see her. So this is how you want to play, right? Yes, that's how it's going to be. You want her, you can have her, but do not rub it in my face. Are we clear? Well, I actually came to discuss this with you. I don't have time to discuss anything with Did you. Then what is wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? We don't have to get rifles over this. Fine, I know you had something with her in the past and she works for you. I understand. Oh, I like this woman. I feel something for her. I want to plan a better life for her. I need her to stop working for you. Get out of my house. Excuse you? Get the hell out of my house! Next time I come here to look for her, I'm leaving with her. If you don't get out of my face this very minute, I'll do something you're going to regret for the rest of your miserable life. <laughs> <laughs> Sandra, do you know you can be arrested breaching our contracts? I'm sorry. Oh, hold it there. I don't want to hear that I'm sorry. It irritates me when smart and brainless girls like you decided to act foolish overnight. What is wrong with you? Something happened that made me take that decision. Whatever it is, you weren't supposed to leave his house without his notice. Okay, what if he claims list of valuables? What are you going to do? I... Um... You what? Sandra, listen. He's not pressing any charges. All he wants you to do is come back to work. I'm not going back there. Sandra. Yes? Tell me, is there any problem? I mean, is this man harassing you sexually? Do you think worth more than harassment? Like what? No need talking about it. Then why don't you want to go back to work? Because I'm no longer interested. I don't want to work with him anymore. Huh. All right. I'll just get across to him and find a way to appease him. Maybe by sending someone else there. Oh my God, what is wrong with all these girls? I want to work, I want to work. But when you give them job, they won't do. I mean, what is wrong with them? Do they think money fly from the trees? They want to get money, but they don't want to suffer for it. Goodness. Huh. Peter, what do I do to get Sandra? What do I do to get your sister? Hmm. See, uh, Sandra is a very stubborn and determined person. If at this time she's not giving you attention, I'd advise you to just let her be. Except you want to be dating yourself in the relationship. And everything was going on smoothly before that mother... Before that punk started getting jealous. Punk? What are you talking about? <sighs> Never mind, bro. I, I hope my sister is safe. Your sister is safe with me. But she won't see. She's not seeing it. So this desperacy I see in your eyes. Why are you so desperate to have Peter, her? Peter, I love your sister. I love Sandra. I even asked her to come live with me. Peter, please ask her to leave that house. I told her that I was going to get you guys a new place to stay. And I'll pay her monthly salaries till she gets a new job and a new better... Till she gets financially stable, Peter. I told her this. You told her all of this? I swear, ask her. That's where you, that's where you missed it now. Sandra will fall for all this. These type of things don't move her. She won't budge. Really? Yeah, no, it's, it's, it won't work. Okay, fine. What, what do I do to get Sandra? Peter, talk to me now. Talk to me now. I might know you. I'll be, I'll be, I know your guy again. Truth is, I don't, I don't know what to say. But I would advise you speak with Omar. Omar? Yeah, Omar is the best person to speak to on this. And maybe she would have a few tips for you. I sincerely don't know what to say. Um, I have training now. I, I, I need to get to the field. 
Thanks, bro. Let me let me let me drop you off, bro. Right, right, that's fine. That's fine. Let me let me join you. Oh, Piro, Piro, I love, I love, I love Sandra. I love Sandra. It'll be all right. I don't know why she's not saying it. Speak with Mama. We help you. Kawaka is becoming too much. Every time your leg is outside, every time you're outside. This is your secret. Secret is, is it not becoming too much? Secret? Yes, secret. What secret are you talking about? I'm talking about the battle between your boss and Steve over you. Hmm. Who told you there's a battle? Nobody told me, but I know. Steve has been on my neck for the past one week. On top of your matter. What did he tell you? That he loves you and he wants you to leave that house. Rubbish talk. But why does he want you to leave your job? Why didn't you ask him? Is he here? I'm asking my sister. Okay, why have you not said anything about it since you came to this house? Because there's nothing to say now. What do you expect me to tell you? Nothing. Sandra. Peter. Sandra, you need to talk oh, so that I'll know the best advice to give you. I'll know the best counsel to give you to make a stronger decision. Peter, I don't need your advice. I have a mind of my own, okay? It's okay. I knew that was exactly what you would say. Okay, so now tell me, why did you leave your job? Ha, hey, 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 God, oh, this is a damn question. Oh. Peter, are you interviewing me? I left the job because I don't want to work again. You, so you're trying to cover up, Abby? You don't want to tell me where you're coming from? See, I'm in this house now to monitor your movements as your elder sister. So you have to be acting responsibly. See, you have to go back to that your job. Oh. Go back and we need money. Go back to your job and bring money. Don't come and sit down here and be telling me, uh, uh, come, come back, come and that job. Go Don't to your me. job. Stop working everywhere. I'll be responsible. Stop going one place. I'm a man. Rest. I will work. Hey, good. Thank God for that underground. Okay. Oh, oh hello. No. Get off it, Sandra. He doesn't care about you. He doesn't like you.
thing and you really don't know me. You have no idea how much I like you. You have no idea how much I want you. But I can't say it to you. I can't. They didn't force you to come back. Because you don't have to be here if you don't want to. I... I came to get my salary. The month ends in a few days. Are you sure you came here to get your salary? Wearing a dress I got for you as a birthday gift. I, I, I made you pepper soup. It will help get rid of the hangover. I've also cleaned up the house. I mean, the chores I've done today should make up for the days that I have not been around. So please, sir, just give me my salary so I'll go. So you're not going to stay till my time? No. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry for treating you the way I did. Okay, please, forgive me. I'm going to be honest with you, sir. You hurt me. You hurt me so much with your words. Sir, listen. I swear to God, I'm not a wrong girl. I I don't sleep with men for money. What happened between us? I was in a situation. And trust me, that's like that's something I regret. I wish I never did it because it keeps haunting me every day. So why did you do it? <laughs> because I wanted to save my mother. Mama. Mama. She's still not feeling better. Please. God. I need to do something. I need to do something. You'll be fine.
good news. I have one in now. Let's take Mama to the hospital. Mama. Why is Mama so cold? Why do you pull cover her? Shift. Sandra, there will be no need to take Mama to the hospital anymore. Why? Mama. Mama is gone. Mama is dead. Mama is gone. <laughs> No, 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 Mama, Mama, please, Mama, Mama, please, no, 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 oh, my sweet Mama, Mama, please, Mama, oh, God, 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 hey, 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 So this is how life is. Yes, yeah, so everything and anything can change for the twinkle of an eye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. Thank you. And guess what? What? My boyfriend, he gave Oma 200,000 naira for school runs. Wow. Yes, that not being enough. He also promised to sponsor Peter and his football academy. Menge, <sighs> you are lucky. You can say that again. God has been so faithful. <laughs> you know, it takes a real man to change a woman's life. True. Babe, tell me, how did you do it? Do it, then. I need to learn work from you. I beg rest! <laughs> well, the fact still remains that he has always liked me. And me, I like him too now. Hmm. You know. Clean your mouth. If I hear like again, this kind man, I love that he love him. I be a... Yes, so. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So now that your baby girl is so happy... 
everything is going on smoothly in my life. Mm. God has been faithful. So on that note, let us drink till we get drunk. Okay? Uh, try. Try, baby. <laughs> if you ask me to see one man like this, your bobo. Chop chop today today. You go marry him. Mama, you don't make me fall. Why you love? Like it? I love it. For Nabi? Yeah, of course it's for it. <laughs> Help me to fold this one so I can. So, by the time you return, you no longer meet us here. Really? Why? Yes. Because sister said that Davian asked him to look for a new apartment for us and it will be ready before the end of this semester. Are you serious? Yes. Come on, this is a miracle. See, everything we prayed for is just happening at the same time. I am telling you, God works in a miraculous way, you know. Wow, man. Oh, man. Sister Sandra is such a blessing to her also. You can say that again. She oh. is. <laughs> Thankfully, she has a good heart because she's always looking for ways to make life easier and better for us. Yes. Mm? And we owe her a lifetime gratitude, you, you know. You can see that again. <laughs> see, but, but you have a job to do. Make sure you encourage her to stay with Devian. See, Devian is a great guy. Yes. And he loves her. I'm sure they'll make a good couple. Of course, they will. <laughs> so, it's your job to make sure they stay together. I would do it. I would do it. Uh, okay, so, let's hurry up. Uh, I think. Mm. Peter, huh? So go away. The food is nice. Ooh. Oh, you come on, I'll cook for us. Ah. I, I really missed your food. I'm telling you. And that's why I made this special one for you now. So be eating this one. Oh, come to the house. Come to the house. <laughs> yes, you should. Okay. Mm. Meanwhile, I have a good news for you. Good news? Yes. Ah. Peter. So you've not told me the good Tell news. Her now. Why are you why are you keeping her in suspense? I got mm. admission into the university! <laughs> oh my god! Yeah. Oh, that was really good news! Yeah. Oh, congratulations, my love! Mm. Uh -uh. Yeah, that's See how our small is going to university, uh -huh. yo. Yeah. That, you're not a big girl, though. Yes, yeah, so. You know, we've been trying to reach you, but ought to no avail. Mm. Peter here helped me with some money for registration, but I still need more money, you know. So the money I give you is more money, are you? Ah, it's more now. It's all right. Uh, okay, it's fine. I will. I mean, you don't need to bother when you have your elder sister, right? That's no. what I'm saying. I will. <laughs> I'll sort things out and give you money, okay? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I, I'm, I'm so happy for you. <laughs> so now, no more writing jam again. Yes, all so. those while you're done. I see. You're, you're happy now, right? Yeah. I mean, you've gotten a good response for the reason you came here. Please hurry up. I need to get to the field. I have training this evening. Ah. Peter, you are training. I like to get to eat. Yes, sir. I like the university girl to break. Yes, sir. The university yeah. girl to break. Well, I'm not, I'm not supporting her. <laughs> I like the. You cook and you don't even feed me meat. Mm, okay. Is, is this not your house? I mean, I don't want, I don't want, I'm joking. Mm. I don't want, enjoy, enjoy. So you can go alone now. I still want to stay back and enjoy more food uh -uh. if there is. Mm -mm. Go stay, ahead. Stay, stay I don't want your wahala. University girl, ah, stop being like university girl. Go, 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 go with him. Anytime eh? she too. Does now. this place look like your house? <laughs> hmm? Because our boss was nice enough to even allow us to come here and visit. And even if you want to take advantage. I think you should add more spark for me. I know how I like spark. More spark? Yeah. You want to finish all the spark in my house? I see, but they're not giving enough money to buy food stuff. How about this? I'll put it. That one is pocket money. Eh, but these ones here, these food stuffs, they are special to me. <laughs> Do you know how I envy my friends who return back to school with lots of food stuffs given to them by the mother? Okay, okay. Listen. Henceforth, I won't just send you food stuffs. I'll bring them myself to your school. <laughs> Sounds great. Yes. <laughs> That's my Sandy baby. <laughs> All right. Uh, do you want to discuss that? Of too? course. Please put everything. Uh -uh. Why is not going to enter this bag? Oh, we'll look for another bag. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here you go. Oh, my God. Baby, <laughs> <laughs> stop. You, you, you continuously crack me up. Really? <laughs> <laughs> if I don't crack you up, well, 
Nobody. <laughs> <laughs> For real? For real. Babe, what kind of... Sandra. I love you. My life will be so empty without you in it. Please, complete me. Be my wife and mine forever. You really had to prank me like this. I'm, sorry. I'm so scared. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just wanted to show you what will happen if you turn down this proposal. <laughs> I'll die. Of course, I'll be your wife. <laughs> You're so naughty. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Do we really need to finish this prank. water? No. <laughs>